In audio, there are two completely different meanings for the word compression, and I thought I would explain the difference. The two uses of the word are dynamic range compression and data compression. These are as different as monitors, as in computer monitors, or monitors, as in speakers. Same word, completely different meanings. Dynamic range compression is what I refer to in the loudness for video. That's where loud sounds and soft sounds are brought closer to each other. For example, without dynamic range compression. Here's a quiet sound. And a loud sound! With extreme dynamic range compression. Here's a quiet sound. And a loud sound! That's dynamic range compression. Data compression, on the other hand, does not alter the soft and loud sections of a sound file. Data compression is a way to make a sound file take up less space on your computer's hard drive, often at the expense of some amount of sound quality. The most common forms of data compression are MP3 and AAC. There are many others as well. In general, the more you compress the data that makes up the sound, the less space it takes up on your computer, but the lower sound quality it has. For example, here's a music clip with very little data compression, only what YouTube puts on it automatically. Here's the same clip with extreme data compression. The music library on your computer probably uses data compression. But like the first example, there's not so much data compression that you can hear artifacts like swirling and muffling like you hear in the second example. Let's review. There are two common meanings for the word compression when referring to audio. Dynamic range compression, which makes loud sounds softer and soft sounds louder, and data compression, which trades off a little bit of sound quality in exchange for making the sound file take up much less space on your computer. Remember, these are separate qualities, so you could have a dynamic range compressed sound that is or is not data compressed, and you could have a data compressed sound that is or is not dynamic range compressed. I hope you found this useful and that it's cleared up some common misconceptions. Thanks.